Hello again, New Haven. I am Miss Megan, the teen librarian for the New Haven Free Public Library, and I like to recommend books uh, to keep you busy, to keep you interested, to keep you engaged. Um, maybe you'll learn something. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, entertainment. It's worth it. So, I have another book talk uh, for you all to possibly check out in the near future, perhaps. All right, this one is called The Magic Fish, and it is by Trung Le Nguyen. And it is a Vietnamese immigration story slash coming out slash fairy tale. Miraculous, wonderful, gorgeously drawn. Well, it is a graphic novel after all. Um, I do love my graphic novels. Um, this one's going to fly by. And you can see that uh, the author and illustrator um, is using color to signify changes in the story. So in one si series you have Tian and his mom who are discussing um, their past, um, their presence, uh, they're having a mutual discourse if you will, um, and the two of them struggle a little bit because there is uh, some changes going on. Um, she, his mom, is from Vietnam and she immigrated to um, the United States of America uh, where Tian is born and so he uh, grows up a, as an American and so culturally they're very different. Their languages can be sometimes different. Uh, Tian seems to understand the Vietnamese his mother speaks but can't necessarily speak it himself. This is a very common immigrant story um, and so they use fairy tales which you can see in blue here to signify and share uh, common themes and cultures and uh, ideas um, because every culture seems to have uh, their own storytelling techniques, their own fairy tales, if you will. Many, many, many cultures across the world have a Cinderella story, which is kind of cool. So the author takes these Cinderella stories, takes different varieties, The Little Mermaid, etc., and, and combines them all, meshes them together into this kind of conglomerate, right? Uh, a, a melting pot of culture and variety of fairy tales into one story um, that allows Tian the main character to eventually, hopefully, come out to his mom, um, express what he's feeling, uh, and, and for her to also express what she's been going through too, leaving her entire family behind in Vietnam. Um, it's a beautiful story. Uh, it's a lot of fun to read. It's got some great fantasy elements, while it's also really rooted in a realistic story. Um, with these beautifully drawn, beautifully written characters. You might enjoy it. I really did. Um, you can find this book through our curbside pickup in the library that you can check out, put on hold today. Um, we don't currently have it available as an electronic book. That's okay. That's okay. We got a lot of great books to choose from. I hope you all are staying well out there and until next time.